coming up, SU football players battle it out on a different field and take in some basic training. I'm Veronica Ramoser, and I'll have that story. From WSYR-TV Syracuse, now in high definition, this is News Channel 9 at 530. College football season is still a couple of months away, but the Syracuse University football team is already getting in some basic training. Some players traveled to Fort Drum today to train with the soldiers. And to show off their newly found skills, they competed against each other in a game of paintball for true bragging rights. Our Veronica Romoser was there and tells us why today was more than just fun and games, but a truly eye-opening experience. So if they hit you, they're going to hit you in the body armor. If you're to the side like this, you have all this right here. Left. It was training of a different kind. It's not like we're working on any drills here, but still it's, it's fun, competitive teamwork, and it's always good for, good for the team. With real lessons they can use on the football field. Uh, trust. I mean, not that we don't already trust each other, but trusting each other in a different way. Trust that guy behind you and that he's going to do his job and do what he's supposed to do to, to get the job done. Two man. Stairwell. Skyping with troops overseas allowed both groups to show their admiration. You know, we're here to support them, but they were supporting us uh, and talking to these guys about how they follow them during the season and wanted to see them win a Big East championship, uh, you know, those type of things, and, and I think it meant a lot to our guys. Having an M4 in your hands certainly makes it real, but while it's just a simulation, this ain't no video game. And there were even a few casualties. Actually, I got a little cut from the gun, and uh, so it's, it's very physical. But worth it in the end. You know, I've always had respect for, for, you know, men of the U.S. Army, but I think now it's, uh, you know, just a lot more respect because I know how much more difficult it is to actually do what they do. For two teams that really aren't that different. We all count on everyone to our left and to our right. Same ideals. Um, again, just different locations, different uniforms, but with really the same people. Coming together to honor all who serve. At Fort Drum, Veronica Romo's our News Channel 9. And many Fort Drum soldiers attended the team's spring game back in April and were excited to have the players on base today. They hope this experience can become an annual event.